man, it's it's crazy to be here today. But what's even crazier, women are really starting to take over the underground scene. If you wanna fuck with me, then y'all gotta pay a fee. And I'm putting in that work, but I ain't like sexually. And these niggas in a flirt, but he ain't no one I try to play. These names, if you have not heard of them, like, what are you doing? Where have you been at? Like, you you must be under a rock somewhere, because you, you, ain't, you ain't tapped into underground, I know that. Uh, we have a few artists that I just have to bring to light, bring some attention to, kind of bring some awareness around the topic, if you know what I mean. First, we have Molly Santana. Up the Molly grinding my teeth. Yeah. Up the Molly reach the peak. You have had to have heard of this name. Uh, she just recently had a sold out New York show that went absolutely crazy. I'm, I'm hyped to see where she goes with this because it's not every day that you see a female come out in the underground space. That's hard, right? I think before we've had BK. Uh, man, who else? Really just BK, in my opinion. That's, I feel like that's all we've had. Now, you know, Ray, hey, they're starting to, they're starting to make a rise, all right? <laughs> They're starting to make a name for themselves in the underground. With the way her sound is, I would definitely stay on the lookout. Definitely keep your eyes peeled because she, hey, she's sneaking to take that top spot. I promise you. If you need some songs to kind of start getting into her, or at least, you know, somewhere to start if you want to start listening. Because I know this always helps me when I'm trying to find new artists. So my opinion, I would start with her 2021 Molly World album because that's where I really first started to understand and like her sound. And then from there, I would just, you know, go up the list with her singing singles move to her most recent album and yeah just kind of go from there but next the name i have to talk about baby osama yeah i'm sorry and i'm sorry her sorry for the way i've been really hurt yeah, I and I had just seen this tweet the other day. It was like, there's so many rapper names with the name Osama. Like, can, can we move on to something different? And it's like, I kind of understand. I get it. Baby Osama, she gets the pass. All right. She she gets the pass. All right. I'm, I'm not even trying to say but none of that. But she gets the pass. Because her music is hard, bro. She is extremely underrated. I don't I don't know how this is the first time I was hearing about her. I just discovered her probably like uh, two weeks ago, like a month ago at most. And it was for one of her most recent singles. I dropped the Instagram post on it. Man, what was the name of it? Oh, okay, okay, okay. The song name was I Don't Mean It. Okay. And I'm sorry, I don't mean it. Why you lied? Had me dreaming. You forgot, I am demon. I was fucking sucking on your semen. Now you know. Her sound, it's, it's extremely different. Uh, it's like she kind of got a small jerk wave, not really jerk, but you know, gives that type of vibe. And yeah, it's just some, hey, it's, it's just some I listen to, it's some I definitely have on. Tap in with it yourself. You never know, this may turn into your favorite artist of 2024. I'll always give it a chance. But for me, right, right now, Baby Osama got it. In, in my rotation, I got plenty of songs by her that I personally rock with. <laughs> Next. And lastly, Caribou. We can run a one on one or you can box the 40. I ain't trying to be rapping till I'm 40. I could tell that she was broke because she argued for it. And, and, and anisia in there too okay i feel like they're both kind of a two-in-one package deal they both uh, aggressively entered the scene right i don't even know if i can consider them too too underground because they get a major yachty cosign i would still put them in the underground category right yachty's already pretty hype right now because you know he's he been dropping some different music lately so you know he kind of got the eyes back on him because of that he got a lot of eyes on on caribou and, and, and anisia and now i'm gonna be honest i'm not gonna sit here and say like they doing something extremely crazy or something extremely different right but the way they sound on the beat is pretty good you know they, they got a good sound their voice complements the beats that they're picking you know it's, it's pretty refreshing for what we you know from what we got in the underground now so that's why i would still put them in this list i still feel like they have earned a spot here but best believe i'm still constantly constantly on the lookout for better you know newer upcoming artists so when there's better that come along or when there's just you know someone else that's fire best believe i'm, I'm gonna know about it and best believe i'm gonna keep y'all boys tapped in yeah yeah, man if y'all really mess with the video just keep on watching them <laughs> all right because what else would you do right definitely click that sub so you can keep seeing them though yeah i'm gonna catch y'all boys in the next one gang i want all the smoke i put on my eyes in the sky i'm counting the bands just me and my man's ahead and i don't know why i'm fucking a fan pass out of my man who tight man i can't even lie